Fuck this show. Words aren't enough to express my distaste while watching this cartoon, and I'm using the word cartoon very, very lightly here. About a year ago, I made a video reviewing Miracle Star, and I made it crystal clear that it was garbage. I can assure you that Miracle Star copied the amazing world of Gumball so intensely that they straight up rotoscope and traced an entire animation selection. I mean, that's unheard of. And whoever made this show is probably patting themselves on the back thinking they're so cool. Really? Fucking this is better than this. Yeah, okay, keep dreaming, pal. The damn remote isn't even visible. Why is the top right of this remote cut off? This is a big animation error. The producers of this cartoon don't even check their own episode. There is a scene where the main character, Chi Chi, is in the cafeteria. Wait, hold on, what the hell is that lip sync animation? Are they just looping animation? The lip flaps make zero sense. Oh, and Chi Chi is still seeking approval from the mean kids on this show. I think it's safe to say that Chi Chi needs to get his head examined for stupidity. I have no idea why this ripoff goat thingamajig wants to get his ass handed to him so frequently on this show, but oh well. Anyways, one day the dad was hiding some R-rated movies from the kids and they somehow managed to find it. Now pause. This show ran from 2014 to 2017. But the TV they're using literally looks like it's from the 90s. So the kids can't get their program working. So what do they do? They decide to reenact their own horror movie outside. I'm sorry, this show is really hard to look at. There is literally an episode where a commercial pops up and on the screen is a wizard with his face being the shape of a sack. What shape does that remind you of? Be honest. What the hell? What is that design, mate? <laughs> I'm so tired of this show. Gumball, kick his butt. My name is Chi Chi. Stop repeating everything I say! But when someone says hi, you say hi to- Some of you might say, well, Kolobi, I don't like the way you're talking about that cartoon character. Be respectful. No, he's an idiot. That's what he is. Every time you watch this show, all you see is milk, 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 milk. The entire season, milk, milk, milk. Product placement is implanted in this show. And the only reason this show exists is to sell a dairy product. Wow. Anyways, this show is really inconsistent as well. The main characters have a modern day cell phone which looks like an iOS device, but they somehow can't afford a flat screen TV in the same era. Can someone make that make sense? This show is also unbearably cheap. I could go to YouTube tonight and click animation and see better quality instantly. If you thought this show was stupid up until now and couldn't possibly get dumber, you're very, very wrong, my friend. In Miracle Star, the students want to play basketball. How do they play this sport? By kicking it across the court. This is foolishness. Any sane person would know that basketballs aren't meant to be kicked like a soccer ball. Can't they just pick it up and bounce the damn thing? Oh, and if you thought this show was only a ripoff of Gumball, I got some unpleasant news for you. They rip off South Park. They rip off Sully from Monsters, Inc. Come on, man. That blue foot in the background, who does that remind you of? Does that remind you of any Disney characters or Pixar characters? It's it's Sully from Monsters, Inc. I seriously think they're not even trying to be original. Anyways, it takes the entire episode for them to learn how to flick a basketball. I think it's safe to say that none of these students will ever get a scholarship. Chi Chi finally lands a score on the net, and Spider Dude gets so mad that he ties him up in some webs and violently throws him into the net. Chi Chi's brother doesn't give a crap and leaves him there to die. <laughs> wah wah, just give me my time back from watching this garbage. Not only is Chi Chi terrible at basketball, 
but he has a terrible family as well. The funny thing is, even though Chi Chi has a horrible life and gets beaten up constantly, I bet you 10 bucks in the next episode, the dude will still try to fit in with the cool kids. I don't know why he's doing this, but he just does it anyway. Like this crap is not okay, bro. I don't know what the moral lesson of this show is. Before we go on, I want to briefly mention I got a Patreon up. These videos take a long time to create. I dropped the price down to $1.99 a month. Just for $1.99, I could bring more cool reviews like this for you guys. So what are you waiting for? Pledge today. Why should we help those bootleg butt clowns? Mm, because... Your girlfriend looks like Shrek. Why are you even here? Now, can someone tell me what the purpose of making a ripoff is? Now that I think of it, if you make a cartoon ripoff, you're just going to get hate at the end of the day. Your reputation will be tainted forever. It's pointless, dude. After binging this garbage, I have a strange sensation to, 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 to drink some milk. I don't know why, but I just want some milk. Circling back to the cartoon, we can see that a lot of the characters are uninspired. Now remember how earlier I told you they didn't just rip off Gumball but other properties such as Monsters Inc and even South Park? Well they crossed the line with this next rip off man. They ripped off the Veggie Tales. This is too far. Everything was fine up until this moment. But Miracle Star, have you lost your damn mind? They could have ripped off Gumball, Darwin, SpongeBob, I don't care. But when you touch a big idea property? Oh no, no, no. Veggie Tales. Veggie Tales, what do you have to say about Miracle Star? Unlike us, their humor can be truly randomly generated. Right, guys? <laughs> Funny. That doesn't make any sense. It's funny. <laughs> in conclusion, if this show was dubbed in English, it would probably be more bearable to watch. Even though the statement I'm about to say may seem strange, I can see how some youngsters over in this show's original country might end up liking it. If you don't know any better, you don't know any better. I wish they could see the amazing world of Gumball, and they probably have now that they're grown up. But this was actually a really big show overseas. But can I ask you a question? Which ripoff is better, Coconut Fred or Miracle Star? Anyways, the show is terrible. I don't know about you, but I'm choosing the amazing world of Gumball every single time I want entertainment. I call upon you now, Miracle Star! That's enough! Take your hands off of Gumball and Cartoon Network's work! This is Cartoon Network's show. You didn't make this show, Miracle Star. You get your hands off of Veggie Tales. You get your hands. Get it off! Get away! You will not beat Gumball. Gumball is better than Miracle Star. You will not win. In the name of Gumball, we smite you down, boy. <laughs> <laughs> the moment's passed now. Is this real or is this purposely a party? Oh no, it's not a parody, it's real. Anyways, thank you guys so much for viewing this video. You guys have a safe rest of your day.